If you've been using XLC, you'll be familiar with naming um, cells of a spreadsheet and using uh, names we can display formulas like this one here. But what happens if we want to uh, take a user cell uh, in an equation uh, that occurs in the middle of a table somewhere? Well, I'm going to show you how we can uh, name uh, cell references within a table. And the first thing we do is we'll select uh, these symbols here because we're going to use them as names and we're going to name them in the normal way. So this is column naming and we're going to name all the columns. But as well, that defines a uh, column uh, reference, but we also need a row reference. So uh, we have now something called table tags. And when we insert them, that's going to be used to uh, append to an equation name. I'll give you a quick idea of what I mean. Let's just say, let's say we include this value here in, uh, in a formula. I'll make this formula very simple, uh, times two. So it's twice the area there. So if I now want to display that, I can display it in this way. Okay, we can see what's happened here. Uh, we've got uh, the cell reference 58 there is A and then M10. And uh, it's used uh, in the display this way. So now we can use uh, cells that occur within a table and we can uh, use the uh, references to include in uh, XLC equations. Thank you for listening.